What's up, my DoorDash gang? What's up, my Grow Hub gang? This is your boy, Kingfish, a.k.a. Big Owl, coming at you with another video. What it do, what it do, family? Hope everybody's doing well on this beautiful Forgiveness Friday, man. Who do you forgive, family? If you're new to the channel, today is Darius Davis Day, a.k.a. Preach, Forgive Me Friday. So, family, today you got to ask somebody to forgive you or you have to forgive somebody. Ain't no need to carry all that on your shoulders, on your chest, on your back. Just ask them to forgive you or you forgive them. Either way. All right, we're going to Chick-fil-A. We haven't been to this Chick-fil-A in a long time. Hell, we haven't even been up here for a long time, let alone Chick-fil-A. So, we can get this Chick-fil-A. I'm going to get my coffee. Excuse me. Had a rough night last night. Didn't get off till 4 o'clock. I didn't get home till 4. Got done at like 2, 3 something. It's been a long week, man. Preach you lucked up again, man. Man, Preach goes vacation or he gets sick right around the busiest, busiest time, man. I don't know if God looking out for him. Or he just lucky. Either one, I wish it was me. I'm a little jealous. Yeah, so preach me back Monday or Tuesday. I think Tuesday. So we're going to keep him on the prayer list. Jeffrey, what's up, man? We hope you're doing better, man. We're going to keep you on the prayer list. Tim and Dollar, how you doing? Hey, Dollar, send me an email so I can give you my new number. I got to find your number. I know I have it. But still, if you see this video, send me an email. Kingfish, a.k.a. Big Owl, uh, at uh, gmail.com. <laughs> that type of morning, man. I'm a little goofy. I'm a little tired. But I got to get up and make that coffee. Get that coffee. I'm gonna go through car wash. I got so many bugs on my car, man. Oh my god, boy, I tell you. Oh, boy. It's <sighs> bowl to bowl tonight. Don't know how it's gonna work out. But I will be there with bells on. Ding dong. Ding dong. I'm gonna get my bowl on, baby. Yeah. What it do, what it do. Now I figure out what I'm taking. Probably take like six balls in there, you know. I'm gonna throw one, but at least I have a variety. Where you at, Mr. Alligator? I ain't seen you in a while. But we ain't got that corona. This manager up here at Chick fil A is supposed to start doing DoorDash. I wonder if he started it yet. Can we go in yet? They got a hand washing table outside. That's the first time. See if we can go inside yet. Yeah. Oh boy. Mm. I tell you. Thank God it's Friday, man. I need a day off, man. I got a blister on my foot, man. I tell you, man. I gotta let this sucker heal. 
Shout out to my boy Bakari. Bakari said he gonna break some records this week, Freddy. I know both of y'all own the thousand dollar club, but uh sound like my man gonna take it up a notch or two. Oh. Mm. Sorry if I'm making you sleepy. What did this person well, I'm gonna see if I can go in. We can go in yet. They're supposed to open up to 25% capacity. But I'm going to see. I'm going to test my, my skills. Let's see. What the hell is a microphone? Oh, throw that. Uh. I'm gonna go see if we can go in. I'll be right back. Yeah, they bring it out to you. They took the handle off the door so you can't go in. And that's gangster. This Chick fil A said, You ain't giving us nothing. Out of sanitizer, but I got some more. I got some sanitizer with some CDB in it, man. That thing is smooth. It goes on real smooth. That way, ain't got to worry about it. <sighs> Get it early. Don't have to worry about it. She'd be happy. I'd be happy. It just, everything I hide, I have to hide in the car. This woman, boy, she got a nose on her. She sniff out stuff. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah, I think I'm going to do a car wash today. Y'all can see the front of my car. Y'all be like, damn. I'm going to be like Ice Cube and Smokey on Friday. That's for sure. All right, fam, I'm going to call you back. <laughs> I'll call you back. I'll be right back. All right, guys, we got our food. Great news, your order has been shipped. We're going to get a question. Go. I'm moving real slow this morning. Man. I can't find my app on my phone. I'm 
to getting what I'm looking for. <laughs> It's a bad sign, baby. It's a bad sign. Let's take Bruce B. Downs Boulevard, Tampa. In 300 feet, turn left on North Palms Village Place. You got to be Then so turn loud. right. Turn right on North Palms Village Shut Place. Up. Then turn right on Dona Michelle Drive. You just told me that. She could be a dingley sometime. Excuse my French. I gotta go get my car. Turn right on the Michelle Drive. I might do a donut this morning. I don't know. In 300 feet, turn left on Bruce B. Downs Boulevard. Turn left on Bruce B. Downs Boulevard. <sighs> Excuse me. So we're gonna drop this off. Oh, God, let me tell you what happened to me yesterday. I went to um, Lake Manly. Over here in Florida, if anybody know anything about Lake Manly, they got some bad houses, rich people houses. So I was in a rich people neighborhood. So I go to the gate and uh, to check in. And I could tell by the way the guard got excited that something was wrong, right? It, it it raised it, it made me put my DoorDash um, antennas up, my Dash's antenna. So I go up there, I give him the name of the person. He got excited. He said, "Oh, I take it for you." I said, "I'm sorry, sir, you can't take." It. He's like, "No, nah, any food come here, we have to take it to the thing." I said, "You a lie, because I was here yesterday, and you didn't take no food, and you don't remember me yesterday." He's like, oh, no, but I'm going to let you go this time. But normally we take the food to the customer. So I was like, whatever. I ain't trust him. I said, you know, something happened to this man's food or you do something to this man's food, it falls on me. No, ain't going to happen. Forget it. i take the food back. No, no, sir, go ahead. I went through the gate, man. I'm riding, man. I pull up on the street, right? The street was named after the person that I'm bringing the food to. I said, wow, this cat must got money, right? So I pull up in there, down the street, and his house sits in the middle of the street. And there's another guard in front of this person's house. So I'm like, damn, like the president. So the guard come up to the car. He said, how you doing? You have such and such an order. I said, yeah. He took the thing, checked around my car and whatnot. He told me, go up, make a U-turn, give him the food. He gonna take it to the door. I said, sir, this is the second person that wanted to take the food from me and take it up to the man house. Uh, we don't do that. I said, I'm taking the food to the man house, you know. He's like, well, this is standard. I was like, I've been here before. This is not standard. I ain't never been there day in my life. He said, okay. I goes up to the door, knock on the door. They didn't have leave it at the door. The guy said, hey, how you doing? I said, fine. Gave me a $50 bill tip. I said, sir, let me ask you a question. I was like, normally, when um, I come to the people gate, I said, no, how did I put it? I said, I'm sorry, sir. I said, I appreciate the tip, sir. I said, thank you very much. I was happy for it. I said, but does it standard that the guards bring you the food? Or is it okay that we bring you the food? Because I had two guards try to take the food and bring it to you. He said, oh, them shame on them guys. They just wanted this tip. I was like, wow. I was like, they be finessing people. But yeah, man, I got a $50 tip, boy. My dash of antenna went up, boy. That's the first 50, $50 tip I got in my pocket. You know what I mean? So I was happy, boy. You know, I held it up in front of him. I'm like, yeah, I see the line. <laughs> yeah, man, that was funny. Both guards tried to take the food. I guess if they would have bought the food, he would have gave them fifty dollars. I was like, wow, man. I went back out the gate, man. You know, I gave him the finger, three, the three finger. He was like, I'm like, yeah, you try to get me, man. You try to get my fifty dollars, boy. I don't play that. I let my thug come out. I said, I don't play that, man. Don't be messing with my money, man. He's like, go ahead, man. You holding up the line. I'm like, what you gonna do? 
<laughs> he picked up the phone. Oh, okay, you gonna call the popo? All right, I'm out, man. Peace. I showed him $50. I was like, yeah, I got it. The other guy wouldn't come. He he let me out, but he didn't. He was too far away from me to, for me to mess with him. But yeah, man, they want to take the man food knowing that he tipped $50. <coughs> so my Tampa Dash, if you go to Florida Avenue and you go to um, Lake Manly Exit right to and Long you go to Mr. Tour. Charles' house, don't give the food to the guards. He gives out $50 tips. He said he loved doing it. He said, oh, I do this for the people that bring me pizza, Chinese, DoorDash, Grubhub. In 900 feet, I'm like, wow. You'll arrive at 5125 Palm Springs Boulevard. You know what the wifey don't know. The wifey don't know. You know what I mean? I ain't seen nothing. All right, 5525. This the one I, I don't know. I think this the price I hate. Leave You've arrived my door. at your destination. Next Evans. Come on, man. You can't park in the middle of the street. The hell wrong with you? Yeah, this is the one you got to put your license in there. But, uh, cheap Christmas. Welcome to Oxford Place. Please have the name or the address of the person you are visiting, as well as your driver's license ready, and an agent will be with you momentarily. I'll be back, man. Ooh. I hate this place. Proceed to the game of caution. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Thank you. You gotta put your license in there. You gotta scan your license and this and that and a bunch. A bunch of stuff, man. Come on, open up. This is one place I hate, man. I can't stand coming here. Start telling these people, leave, leave. hey, just come to the gate, man. I'm tired of dealing with this place. This place is hard, man. They got the speed bumps from hell. All right, she said, when I get to the stop sign, first building to your left. Hello. Hello. Hey, how you doing? This is DoorDash. What's your building number? Do you know? Five. Building five? Yes. Okay. It said first building to the left. When you come, when you come in the gate at the stop sign, you make a right. Uh-huh. And I'm the first building on the left. Okay. When you come back. Okay. All right, thank you. Yes, I'll find you. Thank you. Uh-huh. Bye-bye. Stop sign out here. When first building, that's a thousand. 
I gotta go back out. She talking about. Okay, we come to this stop sign. Ain't no freaking stop sign here. That's a thousand. Unbelievable, man. Okay, stop sign. She do not know her direction. Oh, God. Thank God they got signs out here. Because this helper says she lived at the stop sign first building on your left. That is not true. building is this this building five man this building five right here man cheap Christmas she did not ah! I'll be back family she got me looking for a building ah um, She got me looking for building five, and it's building 15,000. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, man. These people don't know where you live at, man. <coughs> so I made her come outside. I ain't gonna tell her what I wanna tell her. She said building fire. First she gave me wrong direction. I know she hungry. Okay, we going the right direction now. 1500. Oh, there she go. All right, that's a long ways from five. Got me around here asking everybody, where's building five at? It was like, what? Thank you so much. Thank you, you have a great day. You too. Enjoy. I'm glad I found building 15,000. <laughs> All right, Dad. Come outside, family. You got to give them hell. <laughs> she said, build them five. How <laughs> you get five out of 15,000? Do you carry the five, 3,000 sometimes? Or do you just move the decimal over to one? I don't know. I'm a numbers guy, but those numbers don't add up. No way, no how. But I'm glad I was able to get her her food, even though it might be just a little bit cold. <coughs> Excuse me. So family, I hope everybody is doing great, man. I really do. It's a beautiful day today. I'm gonna go around the speed bump. 
I haven't been to this Dunkin' Donut in a long time. I'm gonna try them out, you know. They know me. It used to be one of my favorite ones, but you know, it is what it is. Go up. Gee, Christmas, man. The gate open. The gate had to open all the way up before the arms come up. I'm not having a great morning. So this coffee better be a 15, or I'll probably split somebody with you. If you don't know what that means, Google it. Hey, Freddie, that's messed up, man. On my Bill Blast jeans. <laughs> nah, they made them for men, too. Freddie crazy, man. Freddie is, guys, y'all got to read Freddie comments, man. He be cutting me up, man. He be joning on me big time. You know he from the old school. He be clowning me, man. I can't wait to see what Bakari do this week, man. He told me he gonna break some records, man. He's gonna break some records, Freddy. You gonna have to up up. You gonna have to up it up, man. That's for sure. All right, to the new subscribers, to those that's new to the family, those that want to join, join DoorDash, the link will be in the description, man. You want to be on Team Kingfish, man? Get on the Kingfish, man. They ain't got no bonuses right now, but you get all the free lessons you want, make myself available to you. Just don't ask me how much gas do I use. I get asked that a thousand times. People will ask you before they say, how much money can you make with DoorDash? The first thing they say, well, how much gas do you use doing DoorDash? It's like, how much gas do you use to go to the store? That's how much gas I use to go to DoorDash or anywhere I travel. It's like, gosh, I would do DoorDash, but I don't want to burn gas. I was like, do you drive anywhere? Do you go anywhere? They was like, yeah. I was like, okay, you're going to burn gas regardless. At least you're making money burning gas. All right, guys, we're going to Bob Evans. I'm going to stop and get this coffee real quick. There's no way. On God's green earth. Let me, let me remix it. Ain't no way in hell I can make it to Bob Evans without having no coffee. Nah, I remixed it. So I'm going to get my coffee. I might treat myself to a donut since I work hard in this week. I'm supposed to be on a diet. Let's see, let's see. Let me see if I can find a fat-free donut. Two grams of sugar. Probably not. But I can try. You know. I'm taking my... my um, Diet seriously as I can. You feel me? I have good days where I diet good, and then I have good days where I just, you know, eat everything I see or smell or near. You know? Cookies is my biggest, my biggest downfall. I see a place to sell cookies. I got to try it. They be calling me like coffee. <laughs> chocolate chip. It don't matter what kind. Chocolate chip is my favorite. Of all time. Something about that chocolate chip. Hard cooking. Not the soft cooking. Oh. Oh. Boy. All right, family, we got one out of the way. What time? It is almost that time. All right, I'm going to put y'all on hold for a second. I'm back, family. I'm about to see what we got. I'm about to see what we got. Or should I say, see what we have. I don't want Kimmy to clown me. Hold on. Hold on.
I ate a donut before I drank my coffee, so I can't tell what it, if it's a 15 or not. So I'm gonna have to let that marinate for a second. But I'll be right back, fam. All right, fam. We got our order from uh, Bob Evans. Oops. Let's see where we going at. Telecom. Please deliver to the third floor reception. Okay, receptionist. Okay. We would do that. All right, family. My time is almost up, but I'm going to come back in a few minutes. So give me a minute. All right, family. Just dropped that off. I need y'all to continue to be safe this weekend. Phase two is about to start. I will also do the same thing. I keep myself sanitized and use precaution. I will be wearing my mask tonight. Uh, so with the wifey, so we're definitely gonna be safe. We're supposed to start bowling tonight. The bowling alley assured us that they're gonna do everything in their power to make us safe and sanitized. So they wiping down everything we touch, everything we, you know, any interaction that we make with surface, they're gonna make sure they take care of it. So we're gonna try it out. All right, family, I got to go. I reached that critical time. You know I love you. I got to go, though. This is your boy, Kingfish, a.k.a. Big Owl. I'm out, guys. If you're dashing, keep dashing. If you're grubbing, keep grubbing. If you're not dashing, you're not grubbing, you better get yourself some dashing grub, man. Peace, family. Love you.